speed has more. It's only on four. If you take a look down here, you can actually see raw sewage spilling from Naco Sonora into Naco, Arizona. And it's not just a sinky situation, it's also a potential health risk as that raw sewage spills into Jod Lad's ranch near the U.S. Mexico border. This is sewage, and I got a problem with that. I try to keep clean water, I got cattle, and this is really irritating to have this problem over and over again. Lad toured the spill, which has been running for three months with Congresswoman Martha McSally on Monday. You can see this manhole right here. This is where the breach is happening, and so this is flowing pretty steady, like a river. We've seen it on the Mexican side of the border, and then it crosses over in a couple places. McSally over. says it's the job of the International Boundary and Water Commission to stop the flow. And while a pump has just been installed to fix the issue, she says it took too long. Hey, we need uh, you know greater oversight, greater sort of preventive maintenance, infrastructure investment, and immediate responses when we see breaches like this. Ladd says he's hopeful the new pump will stop the flow, but issues with cross-border sewage have been happening for years and it's putting the community at risk. Bisbee's water wells are at stake here. That, that's what the problem is. Then it gets on to our ranch. We need to have a, a long-term solution. In Naco, Aliyah Shahid, News 4 Tucson.